this is a quote from soren kierkegaard that i found that seems to talk about authenticity this is from pages 166 and 167 of soren kierkegaard's 1848 book christian discourses part three thoughts that wound from behind watch your step when you go to the house of the lord is it not true that ordinarily when only a stranger is present where you are you are somewhat changed and when the most powerful and lofty person in the country is present you are very much changed because he is so lofty and because you so rarely see him but god in heaven is lofty in a totally different way and yet when you go up into the house of the lord god in his infinite loftiness is very close to you closer than you are to yourself since he understands and discovers even your thoughts that you yourself do not understand what an enormous weight of responsibility that the infinitely lofty one before whom you perhaps would prefer to show yourself in your best form that he in his loftiness is still very close to you sees you and yet in his loftiness sees you very close at hand sees you as not even the person who is with you every day sees you even if you in view of your presenting yourself before the most high would try to appear different from what you are you cannot do it he is too infinitely lofty for that yes now it comes again he is too close to you for that. If a person can lose his composure when he is placed before his royal majesty and can forget what he wanted to say, how terrible to be placed before God, because his royal majesty is neither as lofty as God, nor can he come as close to you. Therefore take care when you go to the house of the Lord. What do you want there? You want to invoke the lord your god to thank and praise him but is that in all honesty actually your definite intention as you know language has no more solemn expression with regard to requiring honesty than to say to someone before god is this your conviction what you mean in the house of the lord you are indeed before god is this then your invocation which calls upon god is it honestly meant before god what is honesty before god it is that your life expresses what you say we human beings have to be satisfied with less with one person solemnly assuring the other that this and that is what he honestly means but god in heaven the infinitely lofty one or yes here it comes again god the knower of hearts who is very close to you god understands only one kind of honesty that a person's life expresses what he says all other honesty all other solemnity all mere assurance that one means what one says is to god a deception an untruth such an invocation is presumptuousness toward him take care lest you self-deceived because you do not understand yourself presume to deceive god as if you had in your heart the devout feelings that nevertheless do not have the power over you to change your life to make your life the expression of these feelings from the Hong Translation, 1997.